the front doorsman was smiling at my outfit or at Jesse because <laughs> Jesse said he was smiling at him. I think he was smiling at me. We're in New Orleans. Uh, it is Christmas Eve, and we flew out this morning at around seven or so. Um, and we just, well, we haven't, we didn't just get, we probably landed around like 11 something. And they lost my luggage again. The past like two, no, four times we've flown, they've lost my luggage, so whatever. But this time I prepared for it, and I brought my carry-on. And my carry-on has uh, the clothes I need tomorrow for Christmas dinner and things like that, which is weird because I have all that. Jesse, <laughs> he got his luggage. I don't know how they keep like separating our luggage and then just losing mine, but whatever. So we are at the Eliza Jane and it is beautiful. And I will give you a little room tour because it is amazing. And if you know me, you know that they have a great great tub so i am very much looking forward to that so let me show you the room real quick Probably gonna go find somewhere to get like some coffee something like that not really coffee I'm gonna get a chai latte and then I don't know we might just walk around and see what's up or just hang out in the room because I do love the room uh, and then we have to wait for my luggage to be delivered so I'm just gonna kind of take it easy nothing crazy because it's Christmas Eve I don't really want to be doing too too much and it's freezing right now like uh there's an arctic blast going through like a bunch of the states so new orleans right now is sitting at about like let me see oh I'm gonna fall it is 35 degrees here but at home it's like 12 degrees so it's very very chilly so i'm gonna go get a hot chai latte and then I want to show you downstairs because when we walked in downstairs is absolutely gorgeous i mean gorgeous this place is beautiful if i had a house this is what it would look like this kind of reminds me of emmeline so if you've seen my thanksgiving in charleston video uh this is kind of like it kind of reminds me of something like that. Like if I had a house, this is what I wanted to look. I mean, I have a house, but <laughs> I wish I knew how to decorate it like this because I mean, it's just the design is amazing. So I'm gonna stop rambling. I'm gonna show you downstairs and then we're gonna go get some coffee. So let's do that now.
when I tell y'all, it is so cold out here. Like, so cold. So, I'm gonna put my hands up because it's freezing, and I'll see you when we get there. delicious. I'm trying to see what it is. It's chai, pomegranate, simple syrup, cinnamon, and rum. It almost tastes like mold in my which is very delicious. This is very good right now. Alright, so those drinks were delicious, but now I see a Santa and uh, I don't know. Papa Noel. So, also, I took my drink to go because it's New Orleans and you can drink booze on the streets here. You don't have to have districts like we do at home. Which, we just now got our drinking district. We used to not be able to take it out of the bar at all. So, there goes Papa Noel. Y'all, it's cold. It's so cold. Big boy, big him. Yeah. So now we're gonna go get some booze so that we can have our Aqua de Valencias tomorrow. Cause we always drink those Christmas morning. So doesn't matter where we are, we're still gonna drink them. <sighs> Need to put that mask back on. Keeps my face a little warmer. Ooh, let me drink my drink before it gets cold. So we're back in the room because it was way too cold to have my hand out and recording in that weather. But I got some, can you see this? It is their blueberry Creole cream cheese. The first time we came here, uh, we got a Lambic flute. Lambic is like, Jess, how would you describe a Lambic? I keep saying it's a fruit beer, but like, what would you? Yeah, it's a beer that has a bunch of fruit like put into it. It's naturally fermented. Okay. But it's beer. Yeah. yeah. Okay. But, so they did lamb beak and then they did like some of uh, the Creole cream cheese ice cream in it and they, it was a lamb beak float. And it's very hard to find at home. So, when I saw it there, I had to get it. Because the only one that we found at home was just the regular Creole cream cheese and this is blueberry cream cheese. So, I gotta try it. Oh, this spoon is, <laughs> spoon's doing real well in this hard ice cream. I need like a real spoon. He's just bending. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, Jesse. It's like a cheesecake. So good. 
so delicious. I also went downstairs and borrowed two of their um, like flutes, their like wine flutes, champagne flutes, so we can have our Aqua de Valencias in the morning. But I might go back down there and get a Pimps Cup because we are in New Orleans and I really want a Pimps Cup. So yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna eat some of this ice cream first though. All right, so we chilled here for a minute. Now we're gonna go down and get just like a drink or something from downstairs while we wait for our DoorDash order, Uber Eats order, our to-go food order. So I'm hoping I can find me a Pimps Cup down there or get me a Pimps Cup down there. And crazy thing, these this room has super tall ceilings and it's taking forever to warm up in here. So it's at 73, which is, you know, I'm sure most people think that's fine, but I'm so cold. <laughs> hey boy, you're not cold? So yeah, let's go downstairs. because there was a group of people down there that were one being loud two letting their like kid run around and they were playing hide and seek with him and three they started like picking on their elderly grandpa who had dementia and all the embarrassing things that he did and it was just just so awful so awful so we came upstairs but I got another drink and I asked him to make me a gimlet, like some sort of like seasonal gimlet. And I forget exactly what he said he put in it, but it had frangelico. Oh, oh, oh. there we go. It had frangelico in it, but it kind of tastes like a, it's so interesting. It almost is like sort of sour, but then it kind of tastes like like fruity pebbles in a way it's crazy it's good it's very different but it's crazy um but we got some food i got some dumplings and some bao buns some bao dumplings or something like that i'll show you it looks good though so i'm waiting for h to come back up because <laughs> they forgot to give us silver so waiting on that and then i'll show you what we got all right so i got the sesame chicken and then some rice to go to sesame chicken. Got some dumplings, obviously. And then, what'd you get, Hank? Spicy soup dumplings. Spicy soup dumplings. And then some Mongolian beef. Looks delicious. All right, I'm gonna grow up now.
Christmas. I'm in my Christmas PJs, which I got last night at like 12 o'clock. They delivered my luggage. <sighs> Thank God. Thank God. I was afraid that they weren't going to bring it. <gasps> and our Christmas tradition. <laughs> that was great, Jess. Our um, making aqua de Valencia. So what goes in it? It is cava. Gin, tequila, or not tequila. Gin, vodka, orange juice, and cava. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's really good too if you make it with um, the the pink gin, the beef eater, strawberry gin. That's really good too. So Merry Christmas, y'all. Let's try it. Tastes like Spain. When we had these the first time, it was obviously was it in Valencia? Did we go to we went to Valencia first? Yeah. Oh, okay. So it was in Valencia, and they were delicious. We ordered it in like a like kind of those craft things and we were just like yeah like each of us can like drink one of these because we hadn't tried it yet and so when we tasted it because the, the lady was just like oh we'll start with one and when we tasted it we were like oh these are strong i know they thought we were like some dumb americans but so now we make these every morning as opposed to like just regular mimosas because i mean these are just better so we're gonna sit here, hang out with each other. Ooh, I see my ice cream in the fridge. I'm probably gonna drink that. <laughs> Not eat it, drink it. Uh, and then at some point, get ready for um, our dinner. Cause it's gonna be a really cool place called Kimin Lamar. Kimin? Kimin Lamar. It's French, so I know I'm saying it wrong. So, yeah, we're just gonna hang out and enjoy Christmas. Just keeps calling me Waldo, which I know this shirt looks like Waldo, but I wanted a Christmassy shirt. So, yeah. Merry Christmas, y'all. We had our Aqua de Valencia, and now we're heading to Christmas brunch dinner. I'm dressed, I got my little velvet blazer. Oh, that's real bright. It's because the window's like right there. But now we're headed there. I have my like platform shoes, and we're late because. I just had to jump in the tub for like a good five minutes because I didn't last night because I was tired. That's not us, right? That pillow gets a pillow gets a little cold. But it's really close to the hotel. It should be like it doesn't work. It should be like <laughs> I know I tried to hit it last night, it doesn't do anything. It should be like a quick like ten minute walk, so head it out now. This wallpaper's nice, but Hank is probably pretty frustrated because oh, my mask. I forgot my mask. Oh well, let's go get some delicious Christmas dinner. Christmas. Me and Jesse here, go ahead, arguing about who the uh, the front doorsman was smiling at, my outfit or at Jesse because <laughs> Jesse said he was smiling at him. I think he was smiling at me, but we don't know. We don't know. I'll ask him when I get back because I'm sure I'll be drunk by then. So, <laughs> just kidding. I won't ask him that. And it's what, 40 degrees today? Yeah, so. so, shockingly, it feels amazing. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> it actually feels pretty good because it was like 20 degrees all day yesterday. It felt like what, 18? Something like that, yeah. So.
Thank you. walking down the river walk and it's chilly it's chilly but still not half as chilly <laughs> as it was yesterday watching this uh there's a ferry boat behind us that is parking which is kind of crazy to see see that happening but we're just gonna walk down here and then maybe go gamble yeah we'll gamble for a second see if i win some money last time i was here i did win so we'll see what like 50 bucks to 50, went down to 20. Cashed yeah out. yeah he cashed out so he came back with 20. let's go uh it'll be warmer tomorrow though right yeah oh let's look out here real quick anyway well nobody's here because it'll be packed when everybody's out here give you a little tour of outside <laughs> 